Hey, what's up, guys? Today I got a video for you. Um, this video is on an application that is like sort of like um, what do you call it? Log me in ignition. Actually, a lot like it. Um, and basically, if you don't know what it is, it's a it's an application to where you can view your your computer, your desktop, on your um, iPhone. You can view your laptop, anything Mac, PC. And this app, and if you want log me in ignition, you can get that, but I don't think you really want to pay thirty bucks for it or however much it costs. It's like thirty, twenty, thirty dollars for it. Um, when you can get this app right here, it's called it's called Team Viewer, and it's completely free and does every single thing exactly the same. So today I'm going to be showing that to you, um, and how it's like a better app. Or I'm not sure if it's better, but it, to me it is. I've had log me in ignition, and it does the same exact thing. I don't see any difference at all. So let me show you that real quick. And also, it has no problem with like the fire, like any firewall problems. It doesn't interfere with, interfere with anything, and basically there's no problem. So let me show that to you. So here's the application. Um, when you um. What you have to do is you have to download this Team Viewer application, and then you have to download um, the program for it um, on PC or Mac. It's Team Viewer 5 for PC and Team Viewer 4 for um, Mac, and I'll put that in the description. And just make an account with them. That's free. Download it on your computer, and then you set it up. And this is how easy it is. So right now I'm gonna go to Recent. Um, my number's up there, but I'm just gonna enter that in real quick. So and my password. And you can make up your own password, or it gives you a new one every time you sign in. So I suggest you make up your new password. So here it connected. And then right now it's just connecting to partner. Hopefully it works. Um, one second, you guys. Alright, one sec, I just need to fix my computer and then I'll be right back. Alright, sorry about that guys. Um, my computer was in sleep mode and I just had to turn it on real quick. So, let me re-enter my password. Alright, so, connecting. I'm going to put this in landscape mode or after this. So here you can see here are the directions um, the instruction that says the following gestures can be used to control the remote or mouse pointer. Drag with one finger to move the mouse pointer. Perform single finger taps for clicks. Perform right clicks using two finger taps to drag and drop or resize slash move windows. Double tap and hold. Drag with two fingers for mouse wheel function. Zoom in use pinch zoom using a pinch gesture shake the device for quick monitor switching so continue alright so here's my desktop as you can see it made the background black and everything so I can um, do it more faster but as you can see it's set up um, this is my desktop here's the mouse right here let me try and clear this up a little bit sorry about that quality um, but yeah here it is um, so let me show you some of the some of the settings for it. So if we go into the settings, you have connection info. Um, that's just some information that's happening. Okay, so right here you can click on quality, automatic quali quality selection, or you can do it optimized quality or optimized speed. You can put your wallpaper on or off. It depends how fast you want it. Um, Save recent passwords, instructions, blah blah blah, logging, all that boring stuff. So you got all of that. Um, I guess I just put my background on, but um, so here you can zoom out of your whole desktop by clicking that. You got your keyboard right here, um, and then you can do all the all the keyboard and everything. You have Control Alt, um, the Windows flag thingy. You got this for. Sorry about that. 
F1, all that stuff, F, all the Fs and different other controls. So you have all that. Um, so let me zoom in. So this one go away. So let me just go on to, let's say, Internet Explorer. And this computer is in the other room, so this is working and it can work from anywhere on 3G or Wi-Fi. Alright, so it's going to be a little slow since my Wi-Fi is low, but whatever. So here you go, here's Internet Explorer. You can enter in, like, web addresses, anything, whatever you do on your regular computer. Move stuff, do whatever you want. My battery's getting close to dying, so I have to end this soon. Um, go away. Okay, so... Let's see, another thing about the, um, why isn't that going away, drag and drop. So say I click on this, double click, and then you can start dragging it, but it's trying to, there, delete that. Okay, so let's try that again. Double click, where did it go? Okay. Double click, and then it should be dragging, but I guess it's not going to. There we go. So you can see you can drag it around, move it, you know, whatever. So you can do all of that stuff. Pretty cool. This button right here is to right click or left click. Um, you've got your settings, you've got all of that. That's basically it. And it's completely free. It's called Team Viewer. I think it's a better than LogMeIn or the same, whatever. I mean, it's good for me and it's free. So that's why I like it more. And, um, yeah, so that's basically it. So check that out. It's on the App Store. I'll put a link in the description. And I'll, and I'll show you guys that. So thanks for watching. Um, rate, comment, subscribe, whatever. I'll be making some more videos soon. So, yeah, check out my other videos. All right, so see you guys later.